Here's something interesting I found recently browsing through Amazon. Say Revo 4 Insure Abu Garcia Reel from Amazon um, Warehouse. So Warehouse is basically someone buys uh, something like this, which retails uh, most tackle shop between around $250. Somebody buys it, use it, and realize they pay way too much for what they got, right? So they return it, and Amazon can't sell it as new anymore. So what they do is they repackage it up and sell it as used through Amazon's warehouse, basically. So what do you what do you get from here? You get everything manual box. Um, I guess I don't know if there's supposed to be a cover or not. <clears throat> there's no oil. Usually comes with it. But yeah, it's like a brand new reel. I looked at it. Um, it's never been spooled. I opened it up. Yep. Look at this little nice pop out. That's what you get for two hundred fifty dollars, right? Um, magnetic brake as one of these for what do you call these Centri centrifugal I guess brakes you could use for very light um, artificial lures basically but yeah it doesn't if it pops out for some reason it's on there so you're not going to lose your spool so that's what you get for $250 so there's the hundred dollar one that says Revo Inshore. This one is a Revo Inshore 4. I don't know if it means fourth edition or not, but yeah, if you look at it right here, Revo 4 Inshore, Revo 4, right? So it, it comes with seven bearing, 7.3 um, to one rotation. Right, meaning the spool will turn 7.3 times every time you spin it one time. Your thing right here. If you go like that, that means this thing turns 7.3 times. For those that don't know it, uh, 30 inches per retrieve per uh, turn, and tension. So this is in short. This is what's so great. 24 pounds. That's that's a lot of drag that you're gonna get. Uh, so. Anyways, yeah, so if you guys are just wondering how much I paid for this, I paid $120 for this, um, $250 reel, I paid $120 for a reel that has nothing wrong with it, yeah, nothing wrong with it, works fine, the drag, we got the clicker, um, the spool tension, clicks works great with this little what is it Eva little soft handle paddle handle wide enough it's a good feel it's very smooth quiet all right and let me look at this it's made in not in China so it's made in Korea so Korea does a pretty good job uh, making reels, right? They Korea has its own Abu Garcia models that you could only buy, mainly rods, but some reels that you could only buy in Asia. But yeah, this is made in Ch Korea. We've only insured four. Only thing, I if it's made in Korea, usually they have a little drag clicker. So if so, you would fish, and if if you if your fish fights right it tells you that your drag spool when you turn nothing's turning so it will make that clicker sound to let you know so that's something that I like about Korean reels um, let me get a good example of that I happen to have one right here so this is a Korean made Cremon real so like I was saying turns and then if you catch a fish and it fights back and you have this 
clicker sound. Drag clicker sound. So you know the fish isn't coming. So if you hit bottom or if your fish is fighting back, then you're going to hear this noise. And if the fish starts, you start to, when the fish gets tired and you start pulling it in, this is the sound you get. But I'll do a separate little review or um, breakdown of this reel later. But yeah, Amazon Warehouse. There was another $120 one. I, I thought about getting it and then I went back and somebody already bought it. This is a great deal. Basically, I bought it for half price. Brand new, pretty much. Somebody returned it for some reason. There, I couldn't find any issue with this. Um, no scratch, no issue. The drag works fine. Just perfect. So, good find. I found other Abu Garcias and other. So look out for Amazon Warehouse when you buy these. If you want to get a good deal. That's about it.